What is a standard body? The body of individual vary and each person has unique physical features based on their environment, genetics and lifestyle. For instance, one person may have long legs while another might have a larger abdomen. Individuals with a standard body proportions find selecting and tailoring clothes quite effortless as the vertical and horizontal proportions of their bodies harmonize well with each other. If the upper body, hips, and leg length are proportional, the crotch point align correctly at the approximately half of the overall height. In a balanced body, the distance from the waist to under the arm is equal to the distance from the waist to the junction of the two legs. If the waist is above the guideline, the upper body appears shorter. Conversely, if the waist is below the guideline, the upper body appears longer. On the other hand, the knees are positioned in the middle of the distance from the base of the foot to the tie line. Here, the shoulder width is equal the circumference of the hips. Here, the nipple is approximately 5 to 7 cm below the armpit. The elbow is in the middle of the arm, and when the arm is hanging by the side, the elbow aligns with the waist in a straight line. The waist is equidistant from the underarm to the junction of the two legs. The hip circumference is slightly larger than the chest circumference. The slip length is approximately equal to the height of the torso plus the height of the hips. And the knees is positioned halfway between the foot and the ground. A skilled pattern maker should be able to recognize body shapes. Note that body measurements may be the same, but body forms can vary. Therefore, each individual requires a specific pattern tailored to their body characteristics, considering the unique future of their physique. In the next section, we'll explore height variation and different body shapes.